Uh, we were at Dirt Days 3 out here at uh, Mud Adventures, which is a 350 acre ranch in uh, Anza, California. Amazing facility, ended up being great. Everyone is having a great time. So what we've done is we have loaner bikes, both Moto Ventures and MCCS Yuma through Operational Adrenaline Rush, supplied the bikes. We have 30 some 40 bikes that the Marines can come and check out. And so what we did is Marines who have never rode before, they're starting the MSF Dirt Bike School. Once it starts moving, let the clutch all the way out and then just give it a little bit of gas. Come up the two guns, piece of clutch, roll back out the throttle, apply the brake. Okay, you got it, you've done this already. There you go. Good. More gas, more gas, there you go. Those Marines who are street riders who want to experience off-road, they started in the level two Moto Ventures training. What you want to do is lean the bike right into your body, right up against you. Some people have a tendency when they get off, they step too far away from the bike, and then the bike's leaning way far over. More advanced riders, they're taking the pro clinics, going out on the track or the trails and applying what they're learning. So that's, that's kind of the point of this drill, to not only get comfortable in the front brake, but also get, get that, uh, that position on the bike where you should be. You know, it, this is an amazing event. Uh, I didn't realize it was going to be such a big scope. I mean, there was something for every level of rider, every age, which is fantastic. Uh, that's, that's difficult, you know, because it is such a wide range of ages and of skill levels. So something out here for everybody, which is really neat. The point of today is to come out and just make them better riders and try to keep them safer, you know, at the end of the day. And I think we definitely did that. Uh, definitely experience a different level of uh, motorcycle training. You gotta come out here and do some training to, to do some refresher classes. Keeps you away from the traffic, away from you know other cars and stuff. You're in a controlled environment, and you're able to come out here and have a good time. You know, I definitely uh, recommend this for every single one of my Marines. This morning I was kind of nervous, and right now, pretty good. Riding a dirt bike is like an escape from my day of life as a Marine. Honestly, you just go out there, you're not thinking about work, you're not thinking about what you gotta do tomorrow, or what, what's coming up next week. All you're thinking about what's in front of you, what's the next turn, what's the next step. In the beginning it was really scary because I've never been on anything with like two wheels with that much power, even though it's 125. But you get the hang of it real quick, so that was cool. On the scale of 1 to 10, it was a 20, and I would do it again. Yeah, basically I came out for the kids, you know, it's a, it's a prime opportunity for them to receive some of the training that, that we as service members you know, have received for the past three different dirt days plus the American Super Camps that you fell. I mean, we've just done two incredibly great days and no accidents, really. Uh, and I'm sure everybody's skill level has greatly improved after all this. And you can see it in the body language of every rider. They're confident. But we do it in a sequence where you know they, they get this down, step one, step two, step three, then we put them on the track and, and they got it. So it's a pretty good system. So basically everybody in the whole entire Semper Ride crew has some sort of a motocross or motorcycle background. Each and every instructor is different and they bring something beneficial to the plate of instructing because they've got the experience, they've been there, they've had the injuries, they've, they've been to the top of racing or freestyle and all that stuff and they've learned the hard way and they're still doing it today, passing it on, all that knowledge to these guys in the, in the best way possible. Having uh, Jeff running this whole thing and being a former professional rider, it just adds to this whole entire event. We have an area for the Marines to camp in. You know, there's everything from Marines sleeping on the ground to tents in the back of trucks to huge toy haulers. You know, as soon as four o'clock hits, we're not out, man. We're here the whole time. And, and we hang out with the Marines and, and really get to, you know, hear what they want what they like, what they don't like, and that gives us the information to build better programs, build better events in the future, and, and really give the Marines the training that they need and they want and that they're going to have fun doing. It's just about a, a great event to bring your family to, have a good time, barbecue, ride, have fun.